Coronary angioplasty, also referred to as percutaneous transluminal or balloon angioplasty, is a medical procedure used to restore blood flow in coronary arteries that have become narrowed or blocked due to plaque buildup or blood clots. Most angioplasty procedures typically take between 30 minutes and 3 hours. Upon admission, the patient's heart activity is carefully monitored and an intravenous sedative is administered to help relax the body. A needle is inserted into the radial artery via the wrist and a guide wire is carefully passed through this needle, navigating to the arteries all the way up to the heart. A thin, flexible catheter is then slid over the wire and guided up the heart, all under continuous imaging using a special x-ray machine called a fluoroscope. At this stage, the guide wire is removed and the catheter tip is accurately placed at the entrance of the coronary artery. A contrast dye is injected, enabling the fluoroscope to capture detailed x-ray images of the artery's interior and helping to precisely locate the blockage. This imaging process is referred to as an angiogram. Once the blockage is located, another flexible guide wire is inserted into the artery and a balloon tip catheter is placed over it and maneuvered to the blocked area. The balloon is then quickly inflated and deflated, pressing the plaque against the vessel walls and restoring normal blood flow through the artery. After the artery has been cleared, the balloon catheter is deflated and carefully removed. This procedure is repeated if more than one blockage is detected. In many cases, a coronary stent, a tiny tube made of wire mesh, is implanted to ensure the artery stays open. The stent is compressed over the deflated balloon catheter and then inserted into the affected area. As the balloon inflates, the stent expands and locks into position. The balloon and catheter are withdrawn, leaving the expanded stent in place to keep the artery open permanently. After the procedure, a pressure bandage is applied over the radial artery site to prevent bleeding. The patient must lie flat for a few hours while medical staff monitor for any signs of bleeding or chest pain. Depending on the patient's condition, they may be discharged either later the same day or after an overnight observation period at the hospital. This 3D animation created by Ghulam Farouk, producer, Medicalogy with Pro Farouk, using advanced AI-powered tools and cutting-edge technology. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more medical 3D 